You know, some people uh, do drama about other channels. I'm gonna do drama about my own channel. <sighs> okay. This is uh, under my video with uh, Claire Graham. That's titled Case Closed, Clearing Up Intersex Misinfo. And uh, commenter with a kitty profile picture or avatar, whatever you want to call it, typed, The world needs Exilantic. The world does not need Ben Boyce, a.k.a. Vindictive Ben. Enochem replied, Wow, I love how you assign yourself the arbiter of who matters more, and that you presume to speak for the whole world. Curious, ellipsis, what makes you think your opinion is so damned important? Echo 93. Enochem, Exilancic is important, not me. We need an intelligent person on our side, not an average person. Benjamin A. Boyce. Pro tip. Watching and commenting on a video increases its reach. If you want less Ben Boyce, whoever that is, the best tact is to ignore him, assuming he's a he. Echo 93. Benjamin A. Boyce. Hey there, vindictive Ben. No, People need to know the truth, and I will tell them the truth. You're not even intelligent enough to know that your nickname is Ben. Echo 93 pipes in again. What are you going to do, vindictive Ben? Are you going to get me banned from YouTube too, like you did to Exilancic? We'll get to that accusation in a bit. Ain't no chain. Echo 93. Enocham replying to Echo 93, Benjamin and Exilancic are two different types of people with different types of channel. One gives his guests a voice, and the other gives her own take on a variety of topics. I do sometimes give my take on a variety of topics, but that is not principally what my channel is about at this time. To continue, there are people who enjoy interviews and getting into the nuance of a variety of topics, which I do. Some enjoy listening to Exilancic's take on the issues she covers, which I do as well. There are people who like to have their own opinions echoed back to them, or they need others to tell them what their opinion should be. But believe it or not, there are people who can listen to both channels and not feel the need to take a side, agree with every single take, or make disparaging comments about one or the other. Mind blown emoji. Echo 93 replies, Benjamin A. Boyce had Exilantic banned from YouTube. Wolf bitch. Uh, crying laughing emoji. Echo 93. Oh, sorry. Leyland replies to Echo 93. Wow, that's a bit religious, isn't it? Echo 93 to Leyland. It's anger. That one's got five likes. And by the way, the last two weeks, my, uh, my, uh, like to dislike ratio has gone from about 97, 98% is my normal. It's, now that it's hovering around 85, I'm, I'm being brigaded, as they say. To continue, Echo 93. Uh, Leyland replied to Echo 93 I'm angry that her channel is gone. But X is important, not me and average person. You don't have to idolize her to be angry about censorship. Kate and Nick, Katie and Nick pipes in and replies to Leyland, totally not a cult. Echo 93. Which is why I'm reading this. I love this Echo 93 account. Brilliant takes here. Replying to Leyland, Benjamin A. Boyce. Thank you, Echo 93, for using my proper name. Got Exilantic banned from YouTube. She's way too important for him to have done that to her. We know of one person she has saved from ruining their body. I guarantee there's more people she saved. We desperately need her intelligence on YouTube. I agree I had no right to say what I initially commented. Please stop being so hung up on it. Like I said, it was out of anger. I will not delete it since Ben has not uh, slipped back into my nickname. If she's really talking about me, I don't know why I'm saying it's a she. Just a guess, but Ben has not denied he was the person to get Exilancic banned. Echo didn't ask me about that. So 
<laughs> Why would I deny it? Okay, to continue, we'll, and we'll get to that accusation. I need proof it wasn't him, says Echo93. I need to see Exolancic in another one of his videos, making him money, explaining how it wasn't Ben's fault she got banned. She was going to save countless people from needless surgeries. Now, those people will end up getting surgeries, all because of Ben. How can anyone not be angry at what he took away from the world? Uh, so, uh, I, to remind you guys, Exolancic accused me of being a, a good garden variety German for using the word Holocaust in a tweet about tomb cheese uh, two and a half years ago. And the tweet about tomb cheese, wait, no, three and a half years ago. And the tweet about tomb cheese in which I used the word Holocaust was not about the Holocaust. I was just making word salad about Holocaust charcuteries. charcuteries. And uh, what was that other thing that I said? Uh, 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 sweet meats. Ziggurat sweet meats. Anyhow. So, Exolancic accused me of being a sympathizer to the Holocaust, and now Echo is uh, accusing me of, of being complicit in the ruination of the bodies of an entire generation. That's where we're at in this discourse. Because I fixed some audio and was not explicit about leaving myself out of that video. My fault. Messy. To continue. Leylin. Echo 93. IMO. You have every right to say whatever you want. I just find it a bit extreme. She created a lot of valuable content, I agree. It's just a bit cultish to see her as a savior of the GC world. I really don't know if BB's channel is so very important for YouTube that they'd ban her because he said so. I haven't seen any evidence for that. Most content creators use disclaimers like, please don't go on this channel to pile on. Please don't hate on XY. That's not because they're so nice, but because YouTube is a censorship platform. X didn't. She asked others to go and search his social media for anti-Semitism. And since it's not a good place for GC views, it was an easy possibility to ban her. Yes, Exolancic did explicitly tell her viewers to go and look through all of my social media posts for evidence of a crime of bigotry. She also sent her followers after a number of other people who were mentioned in the credits of the offending video, which is a big, big no-no. I think that beyond uh, the ethics of the matter, yes, YouTube will, will come down on you, but we have no idea why Exolancic's videos were banned. She was criticizing other YouTubers of a trans or transgender or transsexual persuasion, and it could be the case that the TR TRAs, the trans rights activists, uh, go after pretty strongly people who criticize them. That is well documented. It is not documented whatsoever of me going after anybody other than mocking people who are coming after me. Um, but I guess I, I went after Evergreen pretty hard. So again, I'm not perfect. Don't assume that I am or think that I think that. Echo replies, Leyland, there is plenty of evidence, if you know where to look, evidence of me being responsible for Exolancic being banned. There's plenty of evidence if you know where to look. I'm not making it up and wasting my time. It's important that people know what he did to her. Here is how a large FB group banning his videos. There is now a large FB group banning my videos. I don't understand that. Um, what that is in relationship to. Maybe my videos were shared on a GC uh, Facebook page because I interviewed a lot of GC people and D-trans people and uh, have made a lot of useful content, and now I'm banned from that particular group. But um, it, this just reminds me there's plenty of evidence if you know where to look. So in the midst, I've told this story before, but in the midst of the Evergreen meltdown, uh, Brett Weinstein was being accused of being a racist. I had never met Brett Weinstein. I was a student at Evergreen. I was watching as the building around me was being barricaded and people were chanting and running around and rounding up people. Um, and it was really, really ridiculous from where I sat. I didn't see everything that was going on, which I would later see after I dug up all the footage and published it to YouTube. YouTube. Thank you, YouTube. But a 
classmate of mine came up with Brett's emails and she said to me, I, I know Brett Weinstein's racist and I have all of his emails, but I can't find the racism. I, 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 he, he's hidden it really, really well. He's really clever, right? Again, like there's evidence of this crime if you know where to look. So this is all about interpretation. And Echo 93 doesn't seem like the smartest or sharpest tool or phone in the shed or cubbyhole. But I think it might be the case that Echo 93 is uh, a sample of what happens when people rely so much on interpretation, on secondhand knowledge, and on a rumor mill. So all of the communication between me, myself, and Exilancic has now been repurposed to tell a certain narrative that I, and, and to assign to me intentions and actions that I did not express, nor did I participate in, specifically in threatening to cancel Exilancic. I, I didn't do that. I didn't say that. I said that her cancel craving followers should come after me in public so I can bop them upon their cancel craving heads similarly publicly. I was asking, well, I was calling out this underhanded shady dealing of going through everybody's tweets and then like forcing them to apologize, which is a, I won't say that because every word I'm saying adds to this. Strum is so stupid. I don't know why I'm making this video. Let's continue. Anyways, uh, yeah, somehow my words are being twisted that I promised that I, I would get excellence at canceled when I was saying that you guys are trying to cancel me. You're sending your, your followers after me to get me canceled. And I would like to be able to face my accusers in public, right? Instead of just make apologies, uh, public apologies to align to some sort of purity spiral. No, I'm not going to play that game. That was construed as me saying, I'm going to go and cancel you, which is not what I said. And then after she got canceled, I, I wrote her again. I said, I'm sorry you got canceled. I will boost your other channels. And that is me apologizing for Excel to Excellantic on behalf of YouTube, or just saying sorry that YouTube banned you. Is, is somehow further evidence that I banned her. Like, I was actually being polite. But it's all lost because it's all email, and she told me, like, not to contact her anymore. So anyways. But then you have this person, Echo, coming along and digesting all these stories within stories within stories within stories. Not the smartest phone in the cubby hole. Also going on really bad information by people who are motivated by emotional reasoning to reason into things that aren't there. So it's all fiction. It's all, it's just this huge fictional turbulent rumor mill. People are getting swept up in this. I mean, I'm getting swept up in it. I think it's funny though. <sighs> to continue. Okay. Uh, Leyland, I'm not on FB Facebook. Uh, what do you mean the group is banning his videos? And what did he do to her? Echo. Leyland, the group is choosing not to watch his videos anymore. <laughs> it's like, they're, they're a bunch of Ben cells. <laughs> they're celibate. <laughs> they're Ben celibates. <laughs> it's several thousand people. He got her channels removed and banned from YouTube. Did not do that. He now has blood on his hands for blocking people from her knowledge. Leyland uh, replies, Echo 93, how did he do that? You repeat that he did, but how? And maybe you should spend some time offline, blood on his hands? This is YouTube. It's talking, it's words, not action. To prevent children from surgery, we need policies and laws. We need medical gatekeeping and parenting that isn't brainwashed or destroyed by stupid school counseling. Blood on his hands. Surgeons have blood on their hands. Reckless parents, corrupted politicians, and experts are allowing this. It's not about BB or EX. And that's the, that's the whole thing. These topics aren't about me. It's not about the, the these influencers, these these shadow and light games that we're playing. In insofar as the content that I create and the content that Exolancic creates changes other people's minds who actually do things with that content, then it becomes real. But in and of itself, I'm just a mouthpiece. And I'm hardly even that. I'm more of a listener than a mouthpiece at this point. But 
the issue is child children being medicalized. The other issue is uh, the politicization of differences of sexual development or sex development, DSDs, intersex conditions. Um, that those are the issues. Those are that's the actual content, not this. And then you're asking, well, why are you making this content? <laughs> Because it's fun, and we like it. You like it if you got this far. I'm liking it because I just want to show my hairy chest to the people that are going to watch this and tear it all apart. Sorry. How, how long are we in? Whatever. 20 minutes. This is all bait. <laughs> Come after me, ladies. All right. Anyways, uh, back to the thing. But Leyland, rational, reasonable, uh, reasonable, Echo replies, Leyland, like I said, Ben got Exilantic banned. So Echo's like, how did you, how did he do that? How did he do that? Like I said, Ben got Exilantic banned. He did. How did he do that? He did. Now people can, to continue, now people can no longer learn the whole truth of unnecessary surgeries. The fact that people will get unnecessary surgeries now that Exilantic isn't here to explain to them the dangers of it is what put, puts blood on Benny's hands. Oh. I'm Benny now. Exilantic had the best, most informative explanations on the subject on YouTube. She already saved a person from these surgeries. He really messed up. He hurt and will continue to hurt countless people. He needs to rethink what he has taken away from the world. I hope he has a conscience. <laughs> Leyland. <laughs> okay. Echo 93. But how did he do that? I know you said it before, but how? Echo 93. Leyland, he complained to YouTube, is my guess. I don't know exactly how it's done. From what I understand, it was a collaboration with an undesirable. <laughs> what is going on? It's the gold member. Okay. By the way, I did not contact or complain to YouTube about this at all like that was the first this thing from my mind i don't do that i'm pretty in that anyway so maria soul astrology comes along uh another uh blessed uh interlocutor in in this debate echo 93 why are you trying to make gc's look like raving lunatics mm -mm. you damn well better have concrete proof before telling people that someone has gotten someone banned if you are really a gc which i doubt then put yourself together go clean your goddamn room instead of making a goddamn mess of things for the rest of us and you know what that's a very good point we do not know who echo 93 is i was assuming that it was one of the followers of not necessarily excellentic but it looks like this person puts excellence in high regard, but there is somebody, there's somebody who's very explicitly uh, stirs up crap amongst the GC crew because they're really easy to trigger. Okay. I just described myself, but there's somebody who is, who like sends me emails like filled with glee when all this drama sparks up and, and uh, a certain person who's very prominent in all of this drama uh, just decides to go after all these different organizations. She's gone after parents. She's gone after therapists. She just goes after one person after another, after another. And this, this person, the person who does that on YouTube for, yeah, for whatever reason she does that, um, there's this other person who is uh, not totally mentally stable and who I've blocked on my social media because she goes out. Uh, it's been very, they have been very badgering of me, is really, really glad and, and eggs, uh, eggs Karen on because it completely destroys the whole movement. This stuff completely destroys the whole movement. So it could be the case that Echo 93 isn't actually a follower of Exilantic or of the YouTuber who delights in tearing everybody down who's not pure enough in this discussion, um, but is uh, a sock puppet for a, well, a, malevolent, a very a, a bad actor. There's a bad actor. There's somebody's acting bad over here, but there is a bad actor who, who's setting up everything to go against each other. So it could be the case that my information, Exilantic's information, uh, are being compromised um, because of underhanding dealings of somebody just playing people who are really easy to play. Check yourself. Okay. Why are you trying to make GCs look like raving lunatics? If you really are a GC, which I doubt, then pull yourself together. 
Go clean your goddamn room instead of making a goddamn mess of things for the rest of us. Leyland comes in. Echo 93. You told me there's plenty of evidence. And now you take a guess? BB helped intersex truther with his stupid video. Not a good idea, IMO, since it's full of ad hominem attacks and bad songs, and the audio still sucks. I tried to fix the audio, and um, I, I just wanted, there's just this one argument in it. I'm like, that's a good argument. It's just that, so, but the audio is really, anyways. Do you really believe that a little infight between three channels, one of them almost non-existent, um, I mean, Intersex Truther has like 70 followers or something like that. It's a very small channel. It's got like three or four videos on there. Um, very, very small channel. And then me, who I, I guess I'm moderately big, but I'm no, I'm not really big on, on YouTube. I've just been around and I could have been a lot bigger if all I did was drama, but I don't do this. Um, anyway, so do you really believe that a little infight between three channels, one of them almost non-existent, leads to a ban? My guess is that it was an organized move from TRA's or and violation of platform rules. But that's a guess, and I don't claim to have plenty of evidence. I miss Exelancic's channel. I, for the record, I want Exelancic's channel back, too. I want her to be producing content. I find her witty and brilliant and insightful. Said that. I believe that. To continue, I miss Exelancic's channel, but you act if she's the only one who has warned people of these treatments and surgeries, every adult with a brain cell should be able to see how dangerous it is. And no parent and no doctor should enable minors to get those procedures done. Echo 93 replies, Leyland, this Exelancic's exact words, quote, He threatened to cancel me over email if I spoke out against his participation in all this any farther. I asked him not to contact me again. The next day my channel was taken down and he sent me an email saying sorry for my channel. Okay, if that is actually Exelancic's exact words, um, that's a bunch of supposition. I didn't threaten to cancel her at all. I said that her people were trying to cancel me. She literally tried to get me canceled for bigotry. And by cancel, she tried to stir up a mob to go through and find evidence that I'm a bigot. And then she accused me of uh, being a handmaiden to the Holocaust. I mean, that was the accusation that she made against me. And I said, why don't we do this publicly so I can whack these people upside the head? These cancel craving people. I was saying they were, I didn't say, I want to cancel. I'm like, let's take this public. I'm like, let's go. Let's, let's have this out. She said, don't contact me again. And then, and then her channel gets banned. Okay. So it's, it's a, it's a string of, of causation, uh, not causation, but it's just a string of events. And then there's this thread of causation, but there's all these weak points in the causation. It's like basic detective novel stuff here. And I don't know if that's exact, uh, Exelancic's exact words. Again, this might be a troll. And I'm giving them everything that they want. Fair enough. Echo uh, replies to Mary Soul Astrology. Do you not see the total mess going on over Exelancic? I have nothing to do with it. Don't shoot the messenger. If I'm wrong, I'll admit I'm wrong. Until then, I'll stick to what I think. I'll stick to who I think did it. Trust me, I'm not the only one who believes Ben is the culprit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, this is crazy. This is great. Okay. If, if I'm wrong, <laughs> which means that I there's plenty of evidence if you look. I know he did it. I believe he did it. If I'm wrong, I will apologize. But until I'm proven wrong, it's like guilty until you're proven innocent is like not and and who knows who this person is anyways the problem with believing something this is maria soul astrology who says what i'm thinking much better than i do the problem with believing something and trying to make it true by name calling and telling people that one's opinion and beliefs about someone are the god honest truth is that is that it creates the madness of crowds then a whole bunch of people feel righteous in continuing the narrative, and everyone feels they are right because they are not the only one who believes that the target of the outrage is really Satan himself. So because everybody else believes it, it must be true. Like the same thing that happened to Brett Weinstein. This is witch hunt behavior, and it happens in certain environments, certain circumstances allow this to happen. And one thing that it does is the intensity is ratcheted up, and two, the uh, skepticism is ratcheted down. 
And whatever it does, those two things causes this uh, just implosion on, on a belief system and then this explosion of action uh, directed, in this case, at, at a single individual. To continue, it is not helpful to women's cause to do this. I agree. It puts us all in a bad light. I do not support telling fans to go dig dirt up on someone in order to try and frame them as an anti-Semite. I think that is really bad to do. To tell someone off when they do that is not trying to cancel someone. It is irrational to suggest that one thing means the other. Yes, I... I... And when I responded to Exolantic, I did not actually tell her off. I, I made a very pointed uh, challenge to have her tell her people to come after me in public. Um, I, I've not directed any ire at Exolantic at all, because on the off chance that this all gets cleared up, I would like to have more friendship and more time with her. But I will have to stand my ground, especially when things are so messy. To continue. That X has done some good work does not mean that she can't be mistaken here. To try to tear down Ben's reputation because he has said something that one disagrees with is being just like the TRAs. Not helpful. I do not approve. That does not mean I want anyone canceled. I just don't go along with the madness of crowds mentality and don't hang around people who has this mentality. The only reason I speak here is because you are putting us all in a bad light by the behavior, and I don't want women's rights advocates to be put in a category with people who do that. It is very damaging to our cause. Please stick to the objective truth. If you need to spread evil rumors to win, you don't have a case. And then Del Rossi pipes in. Leyland, I bet you are totally right. I heard there are Reddit's threads where TRAs were calling people to report her channel, Exolancic. I have to be honest saying I do not have fact-checked personally. I have not fact-checked personally such claims that people on Reddit were uh, getting ready to brigade Exolancic, which would be proof that, <laughs> that you know, a mob was coming for Exolancic and that I was, pen I was framed, which is brilliant. But some the, this person has not um, fact checked that personally such claims. But and I know that it's against uh, Reddit rules for that to happen. But Reddit applies their rules as we know with how they've treated GC as opposed to other ideologies. Reddit uh, doesn't necessarily apply their rules evenly. But Reddit does have a rule where br brigading this sort of behavior, doxing and brigading, is bannable offense. So. One would think that they didn't allow that to happen, but it's not beyond the realm of possibility that people would be targeting Exolantic. If Exolantic was doing such great work, and I believe she was doing pretty good work, I don't know to what extent uh, Echo 93 is accurately gauging the importance of her work, but she did important work. Insofar as she did do important work, that important work would be triggering people who it threatens. And we know who's threatened by whom in this discussion. I'm not threatened. By anyone um, I will not be threatened by anyone um, but some people are threatened by what Exolancic was doing and it is within the realm of possibility that they would do this dirty work to get her scrubbed off of YouTube and that YouTube would agree with that case that they would make I didn't contact YouTube I don't have a case to make uh, I guess I could point out that she did send her followers after me I'm willing to forgive that it was error or whatever um but i didn't do that there's no record of me doing that it, it's actually kind of not in my character or at least my persona as far as you guys know me to do that um so it but it is in the character and in in the history of of the group that excellence with her work was threatening to continue Many others have taken out from the platform the same way, so it is not surprising. Surprising is how many people seem to have lost their critical thinking over X's ban on YouTube. I was a follower of her channel and also miss her content on YouTube. Exolancic was doing great work. A lot of people love her. A lot of people, <laughs> a lot of people love her and, and understand that, or loved her content, but could draw a line where that content was off base. Anyways, surprising is how many people... Okay, I was a follower of her channel and also miss her content on YouTube, but it is despicable how much harassment and baseless hate has emerged. Vanessa Voki 
being way less popular than X has had her channel banned like three times. Why is it so difficult to think it could happen to X? I think this niche of GC are truly emulating the TRAs that hate on TERFs. Same irrational rage. Echo93, uh, replying to Maria uh, Soul Astrology, stop fighting me. I'm not the problem. <laughs> like, I love that. <laughs> why are you why are you fighting with me? It's not about me. <laughs> like, well, you brought it up. Okay. Echo uh, replies again. Everyone. Go watch the latest video from a slightly twisted female. I am correct about Benjamin Boyce. Stop protecting him. I don't know who a slightly twisted female is, but go ahead and go watch the video by a slightly twisted female. I think she's, uh, she's come into my mentions before. Uh, Maria Soul Astrology. Echo 93, you seemed so emerged in identity politics that you don't recognize ethics. I'm not protecting Benjamin. I simply do not condone your methods here, and I don't want to be associated with such behavior. And I do not condone, no matter who does it, to ask fans to try to find things to frame someone as something despicable that they are innocent of. No matter if they have done something stupid, I think that was really stupid of X to do that. But I would never condone anyone trying to frame her as an anti-Semite, even if she has done that. That is the difference between identity politics and having ethics. People with no ethics won't make a better world if they get things their way, no matter the cause they fight for. So there is no reason for reasonable people to support people with no ethics. <coughs> Pardon me. Echo 93. Maria Soul Astrology, I couldn't care less about your essays. Please watch the videos I recommended. I'm not wrong. So here's a 20 minute video, but I'm not going <laughs> to, I'm not going to read your five sentences. Well, Echo 93 again. <laughs> I love how they serial replying. Uh, I, I do that too. Like, Oh, I have, I have more ideas. I, I won't, I don't want to edit what I previously say because then people will accuse me of editing my thing. So I'll just make another one. Okay. Uh, Maria soul astrology. You're preaching to me about ethics when Benjamin a Boyce, thank you is so vindictive. He got Exolancic banned from YouTube. Did I get BB banned from YouTube? No, I did not. Stop it already. You are wrong. <laughs> Echo 93. I'm sorry. Maria Soul Astrology. Echo 93. Doing something that is wrong is not justified just because you don't like someone. You're the one coming off as vindictive trolling his channel. If he went over to X's channel and said things like, you have said here, I would say the same thing to him. Think about it. If you don't care about ethics, why are you any better than the unethical gender woo-woo you are supposedly up against? Why even fight them if unethical is a good thing, as long as you don't like the one you are being unethical toward? A lot of high reasoning. I don't know if Echo is capable of dealing with uh, Maria Soul's uh, not her astrology, but her rationale right here. So we'll see what Echo does. Echo 93 replies, Maria Soul Astrology, I came here to tell people the truth. You were wrong in fighting me. You were shooting the messenger. Exolancic saved at least one person from unnecessary surgery. She would have saved more if BB didn't ruin her hard work. I'm not the person to be angry with here. I care about people. You just want to win a fight. I really don't think this person's real. Echo 93, BB didn't ruin her hard work. It sucks that she got off, got kicked off YouTube, but it seems very unlikely to me that Ben had anything to do with that. X might feel it is his fault, but behaving in a dishonest manner and then trying to justify that by trying to prove that it is all the fault of Ben does not inspire confidence. This, I'm going to finish this up. I will just go ahead. If you watch this, you watched it. So whatever. She, Exolancic, might be hurt that he gave the improved audio to the troll, maybe with good reason, but from there to trying to frame him as an anti-Semite and then saying he kicked her off YouTube is some of a stretch and does seem like an emotional reaction and not very rational. It can happen to all of us at times to not be too rational when we are hurt and under pressure. It does not mean mean she is evil or never did any good. I hope she recuperates and continues to do good work, which is the exact same thing that Exolancic said about Dahlia when I brought it to Exolancic's uh, 
attention that Dahlia, who was the woman who said she had case, which turns out she was probably lying about that, uh, and pronouns, pronouns, whatever, but Dahlia was disturbed by Exelancic's video and the incumbent reaction. And when I brought that to Exelancic's attention, Exelancic's like, um, yeah, uh, I understand that, but that woman needs help or that man needs help. Dahlia needs help. Uh, Dahlia has mental issues. Um, I, I hope, I, I hope that he finds the help that he needs. So it's the same exact sentiment that, um, Exelantic had towards Dahlia, um, even though, but not the same sentiment that Exelantic took when she was criticized for her criticism of Dahlia. So it's just so much freaking lameness. But you already get that. To continue. I think it is problematic that you somehow think unethical behavior is justified if you can only prove that Ben is guilty. If, if you can only prove that Ben is guilty. Careful with wanting someone to be guilty. You won't be able to be objective that way. The mind becomes like a scientist who has been paid to produce a specific result when one does that. That is how scientists manage to prove that sex is a social construct. It doesn't make it true, though. And I am not angry. Not at you, anyway. More at the draconian governments of woke supremacy tyranny that have ruined our sweet world. I'm really pissed about that, but it is not your fault. I do wish you'll understand what I say about ethics because it is important, but I don't especially want to win you over. I don't think anyone wins by being unethical. So one may say, I want you to be ethical so you can win. Green heart, white heart, purple heart which are the colors of the uh, suffragette movement and been taken up by the uh, uh, women against uh, men and uh, uh, just the, the women who are trying to preserve the category of, of women uh, are using those colors now. To continue, Echo 93 replies, Maria, Soul Astrology, Lady, will you please watch the videos I recommended already? Please educate yourself. This is just ridiculous already. Benjamin A. Boyce, in fact, destroyed Exelancic work on purpose. You were not understanding that this went from my educated guess to a known fact in less than 24 hours. He did it. Accept it and move on with your life. <laughs> okay, then I replied and I, I sent the, here's my Here's my Twitter thread of everything that I know what happened. And I'll link that if you guys are interested in this to continue. So I'm like... I have no, I have no say in what YouTube does, nor did I contact them about X. This entire chain of events was chaotic and I made missteps, but whoever banned her channel has effectively played GCs against one another, gender critical, uh, uh, actors against one another. Here's my account of the situation, which I'll link down below. Echo 93 replies, Benjamin A. Boyce. Thank you, Echo. In order to believe you, we're all going to need you to interview Exelantic to set the record straight. Exelantic. Let's talk this out. Come on my channel. Let's talk it out. Maria Soul Astrology. Benjamin A. Boyce, I had that thought too, that there is someone doing some deliberate manipulation to make us all crazy, but the stars are rare and crazy these days, so maybe it's just that. I'm mostly worried about WW3 because the stars look so much like 1939, just reversed. Breathe. That's Maria Soul Astrology. I've been feeling that the world is teetering on the brink of some pretty bad things um, lately, which actually causes this drama to be a nice shelter from the storm of <laughs> reality. Like, okay, reality's clap collapsing outside. Let's 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 bitch at each other to take our minds off of that. Yeah, I'm sure it's a proven strategy. Leyland, Echo 93, I don't accept claims from people online who act like they're religious prophets. Never a good idea. You talk about the truth and you act as if YouTube videos alone will stop a huge medical scandal. I watched a S T F a something T female. I can't remember what it was. She watched the video. She jumps on a bandwagon without even watching Exelancic's video about the topic. You think that's a proof for anything? 
It's not, and I don't see how your behavior here helps feminism or the GC cause. And I think X is hurt. The caricature was mean. It was. And she felt betrayed. I'm sure she did. But she also takes comments out of context and focuses on one enemy after the other. I hope she can come back to YouTube. Leyland Del Rossi. I haven't checked it too. Reddit is a dark place. Okay, talking about that Reddit drama. Reddit is a dark place. I didn't want to go there this time. I really don't know, but X made the JD videos. I guess that is a trans YouTuber um, videos, and it's a huge audience over there. Maybe they mass reported her. As you said, Vanessa Voki was banned three times. A lot of division and infighting over all of this. I hope she can come back and the drama can end. Echo 93. Leyland, my knowledge is out there now. BB knows he's getting blamed. He's getting blamed for it because it's way too much of a coincidence. Do you know what that coincidence entails? If not, please leave me alone. Leyland replies, Echo 93, yes, because I watched the videos and listened. I don't agree with some claims X Atlantic made. That's possible, you know, although I admire her for other things. I don't have to agree with everything. Echo 93 replies, Leyland, and there you go. Let's agree to disagree. The end. Goodbye. Maria Soul Astrology, Echo 93, I just lost a job and you have been hostile towards me here. Does that mean it was you that made sure I lost the job? Should I make videos about it telling everyone you did it? You're not helping women by doing this. You only give our cause a really bad reputation. You make us all seem mad by association, just like you would think I was mad if I accused you of costing me my job. Have, having tried to frame Ben for something that isn't true, I, I will admit, I will say that it's not true. But, I mean, you have to take my word for it. <laughs> I mean, we don't know. YouTube's a black box. They're not going to tell us. I mean, maybe they told X Atlantic, but I don't know. <laughs> but how, how do I prove that I didn't do something that we have no proof that I could have done? I mean, you look at my behavior, whatever. Anyways, anyways. <sighs> Having tried to frame Ben for something that isn't true and then not apologizing for that, but demanding that Ben has to clear it up and keeping accusing him of being the boogeyman does not inspire sympathy from reasonable people. On a scale of, from, on a scale of, from one to 100, how sure are you that you are doing the right thing by this? Echo 93 replies, blah, blah, blah. Maria Soul Astrology, fan of Greta. And that concludes uh, this morning's um, bathrobe reading of inner channel drama from the voice of reason. I hope you enjoyed this programming um, as, as is a Tradition in my channel, but not for the interviews. Here's some kitty cats. Good night. Give me a 